Infectious diseases are unique because many of them can be spread from person to person and therefore they have epidemic potential. As long as microorganisms have the capacity to mutate and change, infectious diseases will remain a threat to human health. There's an urgent need to upskill the capacity of healthcare workers and personnel, including doctors and nurses, to be able to respond to infectious diseases threats from a population health perspective. The Infectious Diseases Intelligence Program meets a need for upskilling practitioners so they can meet these challenges more appropriately. It can be taken as a graduate certificate, diploma or masters, each of which can build up to the next level of qualification. Our academics are at the cutting edge of research in infectious diseases, so students have the benefit of learning from academics who are continually developing new research ideas in infectious diseases. The core course of this program will introduce you to the challenges of controlling and managing infectious diseases through an appreciation of activities such as undertaking surveillance and outbreak investigations. Using state-of-the-art technology, our courses can be delivered fully online so that busy clinicians and other health professionals who work full-time and wish to study while working can do so at their own convenience. So we use Moodle. It creates a private website for the course where you can get all of your course readings, lecture slides and multimedia content. All the lectures are recorded um, and I can watch them via Echo 360. I can also go back and re-listen to things that I've missed. The way the program is designed, you can start with a graduate certificate, which you can extend into a graduate diploma. This in turn articulates into our master's program. Many people start at the grad certificate level because they have a healthy interest in the subject, but then they discover they want to know more. And they continue on up to a master's and even a PhD level, so the interest blossoms into a specialization. Alumni from these particular courses have actually worked in the front line. For example, Haiyan in the Philippines was a key example where our alumni have worked in the forefront and have managed to communicable diseases. So it is important that public health professionals in the field are well aware of, well equipped and have got the capacity to be able to manage and front such disasters in, in, in many parts of the world.